Hello everybody, today is day 12 and yes, I'm in my red shirt, like I told you, all these 21 days I have this red shirt right here and anytime I make this video, I put the red shirt on so because I like to keep those days under the same color, so let's see, just for fun and I hope you finish your picture from yesterday and brainstorm uh based on those questions that we uh, talked about yesterday and today i have question of the day and limiting beliefs and also three circles that would be represent trust create and visualize please write down the date and question of the day how can i attract success by aligning my thoughts, my beliefs, and actions with my goals. Find yourself, so find yourself here in the picture and see where you feel yourself. So here I am with my thoughts, my beliefs. So today I feel so inspired and feel good so this is how i feel i grow i have more ideas and yet i have some limiting beliefs and today i word them differently i'm gonna tell you but let's draw right now so first is do i really can achieve my goals do i really can achieve my goals See, I put a little bit positive. Do I really can achieve my goals? My goals, of course. Of course, would be like, well, think about it. do I really can be consistent and gain momentum? Can I really be consistent and gain momentum? Remember how momentum is important? Yes, I can. I can. I did it before and I can do it again. Do I really depend on somebody else's opinion? Do I really depend on somebody else's opinion? We need to rely on only our opinion. Because when we are can be happy within without anybody else changing your mind, changing your mood, changing um, your goals because of their opinion, no good. So let's let me tell you so we write it down because i keep a track for myself so limiting beliefs for today number one do i really can achieve my goals Second one, do I really can consistent can be consistent and gain momentum? Very important, I think, to write it down with your hand because you connect here with your brain, your body, and you put out the words. And while you write that, write it down, you work on yourself. You start to really think you already have answers for these questions. Do I really depend on somebody else's opinion? And when you say that, 
And if you do depend on somebody else's opinion, then it can it can e easily it can be easily transformed. So you need just keep working on yourself with classes like this or something similar that it really work with your subconscious. It's really help you to rethink and reshape your understanding in a different way. Okay, and now we have this picture. Let's draw this lines from from society, from universe, from God, from our angels with with answers for our for our questions. And I show you. So the first was, do I really can achieve my goals? Do I really can achieve my goals? And here I do. I really can achieve my goals. Is that possible? Yes, it's possible because I see thousands of people prove that it's possible and it's easy and you're doing what you love to do and you feel good and you make difference and you help other people in some way. Maybe you just if I just make somebody smile, I'm happy. And so what was the question? Do I really can achieve my goals? One more line. Do I really can achieve my goals? Yes, I can. And I love to do what I what I do. I love to share with with everybody those tools. That is very simple. It's creative and it's changing your mind right away. So that's what I do right now for myself. And I invite you to share this journey with me because it's fun and i feel the difference i feel so many things happen just like this if i have a question i open the right video for me if i have a question i get an answer right away and where i am right now i'm super comfortable and yes i have my goal and my goal to have five more thousand a month and I want more subscribers. More subscribers, I want 100,000 subscribers. That was my intention. So in a, by now I feel how I want to shape and change my questions. Do I really? So the question would be yes. You see, I'm starting to work with my subconscious, with my mind, to give it perspective that it's possible and it's easily possible. So I am attracting to myself this vibration, what I want to be aligned with. Okay, and number two, do I really can be consistent and gain momentum? Yes, I can be consistent and gain momentum because it happened many, many times. And it's actually easy. It's easy to be consistent. It's easy to gain momentum. All I want to do is focus on what I want. And it will happen easily. Because when I do what I love to do, I don't even know how much time I spend with that. And what last question, do I really depend on somebody's opinion? Do I really be, depend on somebody's opinion? I even feel like I want to put some lanes from, from myself out there and break this. Like, like I don't depend on anybody's opinion. And and I, I'm feeling very confident in what I, I do. And I'm feeling very confident and proud on my ability to be separate to be free from somebody else's opinion because my opinion most important i know i do the right thing and i am happy with what i do it's make me happy it make me vibrant it's make my heart sing and i love to share this i love to share because i know how much helpful it is for it was for me so it would be for other people so okay so now i stop here those three questions we put out and you still have question of the day can i track success by aligning my thoughts 
beliefs and actions with my goals. And now we have three circles and put those circles and number those circles randomly. Just unexpectedly even for yourself. So uh, I always so, did one, two, three. Today I did three, two, one. Okay, and the num number, I tell you what is it of the day. A little bit somewhere else. In seconds. First is trust. Second is visualize. Visualize. And third is create. So what I did, I just passed, because I have all this reading uh, rolled down the classes and I want to be even surprised those circles even for myself so three for me today will be create second visualize and first is trust interesting so and now I will take my time and I round the circle uh, corners and I just think about what just happens what information I just put out right there and what while I'm thinking this way and just put those lines out and just double double them up. What that's what I do. I, I imagine I just put more energy through it. So it's like each line it's represent energy kind of flow. So you feel you start to just go around this around the corner. So what I do, I make circle inside those lanes and then if I want to around the corners I do but whatever you feel and this is just calm me down I feel much more relaxed I start to feel connected with my body I start to feel Real, kind of like um, my thoughts go much easier you know ideas come much easier so just follow your thoughts what ideas come to you and if something important please write it down write it down because once you write it down you don't have to keep that thought in your head you can allow much more thoughts coming to your head you see what i mean that's a little secret if you want to remember something, write it down and allow yourself to let go and by not thinking about this and try to, wait, wait, I don't want to forget. I don't want to forget. It happened to me many times, same thing. But when I write it down, I know that, okay, I wrote it down some, somewhere so I don't have to keep it in mind. And just go with the flow. Breathe with your belly. And now I'm in number three. So I work on around circle number three, not even on myself. And three was create. So I need I uh, ready for create something so since i since i look at this process of 21 days of working on myself which is my pro my project um, put together my ideas uh, brainstorming about my next video and also brainstorming about my my goal what i want 
And what I see, I want to be, it's inspired me more and more because I do more research about my goal, which is I'm talking about right now. And I spend more my energy and focus on my uh, goal. And I do it now daily. And yes, a couple of times I couldn't make my video, but overall, I'm proud of myself. I just keep working this direction. And compared to what I used to do before, like last year, I'm a champion. How about that? I am a champion. So tell yourself you're a champion. Compare yourself to yourself. Why I tell you my story? So you can think about your story. You can think about your uh, challenges maybe. Maybe something you learn. Maybe something that you can monetize. If it's your question, like it's my question. I like um, create five, five more thousand for my income in my income so and this is inspiring me because it's i told myself that's it i will do it i'm ready and i put this challenge out first of all for myself and if you join i'm grateful i love to feel this energy of changes and you know, I would feel to put this line here, like a, something like this. So in brainstorm, what is it for you that triggers you? and inspire you to go forward and be successful. What is it for you? And by thinking and thinking over and over, you firing up those neurons. See what happens? More we think, more we think, it happens, it happens, and your reality will change because this is habit. And what that means, it's not luck, it's habit. Look around, how do you live? Are you happy how you live? If you are happy how you live, those neurons get stronger, stronger and stronger. Here, that's what you want to create new. They get together, they stick together, and they grow too. That's what we do here. So just breathe and relax. Your body is a key. Your body is a key for aligning yourself with the energies when you feel the most happiest and accomplished and all these beautiful words. Allow yourself to be Okay, breathe in, breathe out, allow yourself to be, and I will see you in a couple minutes.
so I am done with my picture and for some reason I had so many hearts and I felt like why not why not I put hearts hearts I couldn't stop to make hearts so I feel excited day number 12 is done and I'll see you in the next video. But before, I like to do a short meditation for you to ground down whatever feelings we dig in, whatever we had in our mind. So uh, please get comfortable, sit straight. I'll pick in my notes and close your eyes. Relax your shoulders. I show you how. Bring your shoulders up, back, and drop it. So now you're comfortable. Relax your neck. You can just swing your neck back and forth. Make a deep inhale and breathe with your belly comfortably. If you like to yawn, yawn. Yawn one time, yawn two times. It's very good sign of relaxing. When you're yawning, you're relaxing. And get a lot of oxygen in your bloodstream. And now relax your face, relax your eyes. And dive in, in your comfortable and beautiful space where you can relax. And possibly it's your paradise. Breathe comfortable with your belly. And now in your paradise, you know that you protected by divine love in this very space and all this beauty and fresh healing air you breathe you relax and now you close your eyes in their beautiful place and imagine what you've just done this work about how can I attract success by aligning my thoughts, beliefs, and actions with my goals. And see what ideas will come to your mind. Pay attention. And if you feel like some idea come up, you can write it down and then close your eyes again because with your closed eyes, you see much more. You feel more. And ask those questions and see the immediate answers for those questions. Do I really can achieve my goals? Remember that picture you drew today? And see what you can attract to yourself. And attract those goals to you. What steps you can attract? What connections? Think what it is for you. Next question. Do I really can be consistent and gain momentum? What is gain momentum for you? gain momentum when it happens effortlessly it just happens it just imagine like a big wheel you try to turn it 
like on a bike. Remember when the first time you try to turn the wheel on a bike? You need to catch momentum. And then bike go on its own. Then bike carry you around. And see how you can catch momentum. What little simple step you want to take to catch the momentum. Ask yourself and see the answers. Do I really depend on someone else's opinion? And now answer this, do I really care about somebody else's opinion? Most of the time, those people who have opinions that make you feel not comfortable or does, does it feel, does it not feel good? Think about those people probably have their own issues. Maybe they're not just in the mood. Breathe and feel and see the answers. And now look over your picture in your mind and see how beautifully it's lay out right now. You have all these lines connected, all these circles connected and connect yourself to the society, to, to this field of infinite possibilities. And you don't even know those lines, what they lead to. Your subconscious knows. You create this beautiful symbol to you for your country subconscious with these feelings and now your job is just relax into the process focus more about that think about those questions again and gather more positive thoughts Make a deep inhale, and now you're back in your paradise. You have these beautiful feelings that it's all done because you want it, because you can, and that makes you feel good. Now make a big inhale and slowly come back if you want. Or you can stay in the same pose and just think more about that. And I will see you in the next video.